Well, here's a video tutorial on how to use the Talk with Fish app. When you first buy it, you get three uh, fish calls. We're going to take a look at the bass. You get the, uh, now I've already bought these, you get the crawfish eaten by predators. You hear that. That's bringing in bass because they hear other bass eating uh, crayfish. You can also uh, use a slider to when you want to repeat it. The slider is on, it's off. We're going to turn this down and so it's going to repeat within a few seconds. See the blue line going down and then it's going to repeat. Oftentimes you want uh, 15 to 45 seconds in between uh, those. Let's pause that. Let's go back to B buzzing on the water. That again is to bring them in to uh, feed on that type of uh, food. Now, if you uh, don't have the uh, all of them, it's going to say fish calls that can be purchased. You, right here, I don't have the darter minnow, the fathead minnow spawning call, frogs, goby minnows, shiner minnow aggressive call. And But if I want the shiner minnow aggressive call, I can uh, go to the store and purchase them. So I'll say yes, I want to purchase it. Now we've got uh, these four packages, fresh water, salt water, additional, and complete. Now you can go to the website if you want to, to view what calls come in each of these uh, packages. One thing to remember is you're getting the calls, but they won't show up on each species. Here's uh, the website. And here's the calls that come with the freshwater package. One example is the loons and ducks will not show up in the bass or panfish because bass and panfish don't eat loons and, and ducks. The, uh, however, the muskies do. So let's go back to the uh, fish species and we'll look for uh, crappies, muskies. Okay, gonna look for muskies. We're going to find the loons calling right here will show up. So um, if you're wondering why it doesn't show up on each one, that's why. And we can have not purchased that yet. And we can go back and uh, take a look at it. Now we can go to the About page. It tells about the history of um, sound in fishing, the underwater acoustics. You can go to the website. You can uh, make the calls of favorites. There's K resonance uh, that uh, keeps zebra mussels from uh, going on to your boat. There's, there's a number of different things here, but as you can see, it's easy to navigate around and uh, look at these. Here's Nassau grouper, perch, pompano, salmon, and the herring farts. The interesting thing about the herring farts is it's just discovered in the past 10 years the uh, Swedish government thought that there was Soviet spy submarines in their uh, Stockholm Bay when they heard this and it turned out it was the uh, herring farts. The fishermen use this to um, for salmon, anything that eats herring, to be around the school because they're communicating with each other and those uh, predator fish are, are going to key in on this sound as well. It's gas expelled from their anal opening. Well, I think giving you kind of an idea of uh, using these various songs, frogs, croakers, um, frog singers, we, all of these things that are uh, uh, useful in helping you catch fish. Good fishing.